It is time for Sunday brunch. Joining us in the Reese's Kitchen is Natalie Michaels with some delicious smelling food already. I yes. saw barbecue, I saw bacon, I saw burgers. Can't go wrong with That's that. That's right. Yeah, you know, this is a take on a summer bur burger that also has the barbecue twist. Mm. So, yeah, you can't go wrong. <laughs> I'm starting with a pound of ground beef. And I've added a quarter pound of J.C. Potter sausage, which is a made in Oklahoma product you can find anywhere. You just mix it all together. Mix it all together. So you know, some people you may have had a sausage burger before. This is sort of that flavor, but not full sausage. So oh, nice. A pound to one quarter, and then I'm adding a teaspoon of Head Country all-purpose seasoning. And this is great seasoning that you'd think of using for ribs or brisket, but it makes a great burger seasoning Very too. Nice. Yeah. So you'll mix that right in, and then I'm going to add about a half a cup of Head Country sauce. Okay, you're a pro; you can just measure half a cup just <laughs> right. like that. I can't well, do that. Well, pretty well. <laughs> and you know, this is going to make a, a great flavor, but also um, a really moist burger. And of course, these are best if you want to do it out on a on a charcoal grill. Oh, right. But um, we're inside, so I'm going to go ahead and show you. I've, this will make about six hamburger patties, and you'll just put it right on to cook. That's a great sound. Yes, isn't it? <laughs> it me. really yeah. is. Mm -hmm. And then the really great thing too about these burgers is the sauce. Oh yeah. So once that burger is all done, you're going to have about uh, a quarter cup of mayonnaise. And about a quarter cup of Head Country barbecue sauce that you're going to mix together. I know that may sound strange, yeah. but it makes a really delicious sauce. That's it, so, too, right? Yeah, that's wow. that's it. And this is a delicious sauce you'll put right on top of the of the bun when everything's all finished, and then top it with some bacon. Very I used nice. Bar S bacon, which is an, another made in Oklahoma product, and that hot bacon with the barbecue sauce and oh, the burgers very nice. makes a really really good cookout. Food. It sounds like a great combination. And you're talking about using it on the grill outside. Do you do it basically just the same way? Put it on the grill, or is there any kind of modifications you have to do? Absolutely. Yeah. You know, I, I've made these inside and outside, and either way is just fine. Um, you know, if you're if when you're doing it inside, you're going to want kind of a hot grill. Once once you're able to turn it, you'll know when it's not sticking. You can flip it. Oh right. <laughs> and outside, you'll want to cook it a few minutes on each side on a medium high grill. All right. Flame. Can't wait to taste it. We'll be back in a little while to taste that, of course. If you'd like to go ahead and get a look at the recipe, you can see it on our website, kjrh.com.